the family atmosphere matters in the fire service. It was an evening of answering questions and camaraderie. It's always wonderful to have people come in and show us new things. Personnel from Milford Fire and Rescue and Bradley Fire Department were given safety training on two alternatively fueled vehicles to learn the hazards and how to respond in the case of an emergency. First, a propane truck from Yellow. The Milford Fire Chief contacted our company and asked us if we would be willing to bring one of our trucks out because our trucks do run on propane, which is not a very common fuel. And an electric vehicle from Versant Power. We tend to hit heavy with vehicles on like where the batteries are placed and some access the firefighters can gain in the event that these um, vehicles like heat up and may cause fires. They do seem like they're fairly cut and clean. They, they drive around and look uh, like any, any vehicle along the same size until you kind of get underneath the hood. We have to always be training for it. We have to be thinking about it and we have to be ready for it. Before the training course, a cookout, bringing together two neighboring departments. We work quite frequently together on calls. You know, they're our closest mutual aid, you know, next to Old Town. So they always show up when we, when we call. We always show up when they call. Um, sometimes it's nice to just kind of put the gear away and get some food into us and laugh, joke, and kind of get to know one another. All the fire departments in the area work very well together, and it has to be a team. If we're not a team, we don't get nothing accomplished. In Milford, Doug Banks, ABC 7, and Fox 22 News.